hello guys you welcome back again to my channel it's your worry girl here i greet you all depending on where you're watching me from if today's your first time here thank you so much for tuning in to my returning viewers to my subscribers thank you so much for your massive support i really do appreciate all you guys are doing in this channel so guys let's dive into today's video on the 16th of uh of april 2023 we saw what played out in the palace of the olu of worry you guys saw it hey <laughs> honestly i was just laughing because you know there are a lot of comments out there people are seeing the negative side some people are seeing the positive side but today guys i promise you that i'm going to bring people's reaction about what happened last Sunday, which was on the 16th of April, 2023. So we saw how um, Ologbo Shere, the former Ologbo Shere, Ayiri Emami was removed. We saw how he dropped his bead. You know, all the beads and the uda and everything that belongs to the king. And last Sunday, we saw him when he came to the palace he portrayed before the king or he knelt down before the king and he submitted his uda and the uh, beads and guys i have a lot of comments here like someone said i will be bringing them shortly someone said that there is no way you can be having problem with the king and you still want to be his olobo share how possible is that will you even die like the king have said that he doesn't have enemy <laughs> guys <laughs> i don't know even if the king doesn't have enemy does that makes people not to be his enemy you know people have him as his enemy but he doesn't have anyone as his enemy so guys a lot of people they've reacted negatively why some other persons they've reacted uh, positively so guys this is this comment i don't know but this comment i will not be putting the names of those people that reacted both positively and negatively but guys i'll read this comment out i want you guys to contribute your own quota this one says so guys i'll be taking this first comment this one say it appears ayiri a mami was outsmarted by the king there was a reconciliation meeting with the promise that it will be reinstated he said i assume this because knowing ayiri for his pride he won't accept anything short of this he has been dropped by the king's pronouncement over his failure and refusal to come for revalidation some time ago. This was due to his antagonism of the king based on his belief that he wasn't the right, rightful person to ascend the throne. I think the intervention of respected citizens, especially traditional rulers like the Oni of Ife, who paid him a visit in his house would have made him have a rethink. After submitting his bid and order to the king, he was informed he won't be reinstated but given his late father's title. Ayuri refused and walked out. The king went ahead and installed a new Ologboshere. Ayuri thereafter went to his house with his teaming supporters and told everyone that it was a fake bid and order he gave to the Olu. I don't think this is of any significance because he has already submitted to the lordship of the king by Ninil before him. Knowing Ayuri to be stubborn, I believe he will fight back. Some reports have it that majority of the Ologboshere family members and key stakeholders are in support of Ayuri Emami and they still regard him as the Ologboshere. Can the king appoint an Ologbo Shere without the input of the Ologbo Shere family members? Hey, guys, I just want you guys to react to this particular statement, okay? But you guys should not forget that this is not when the whole thing started. When uh, the other chiefs, they were coming for revalidation, don't forget that Ayuri Emami, he was not there. Why? Because he was still fighting with the king let me put it that way you know whether it's cold war or anything so he was still of the opinion that the king is not the rightful person to ascend the throne and so therefore he cannot recognize that king as his own king but now when they settle the whole matter when they try to make peace with them 
But guys, Ayuri went back to the palace. Do you think the king would still give, uh, would have given that post, that Ologboshere post to Ayuri and Mami? Knowing that this particular person is the person that was kicking against his own, his own throne. We, do you think he, if it is you, will you even agree that you will make a re Let's remove it from sentiment or anything. Just think if it is you, will you agree? So this is number one question. No, please. You push your answer respectfully. So guys, let me bring the second one. So, my beautiful people, this another comment. This one says, it beats imagination that even Olu could not recognize and differentiate between the real and fake Oluk Boshere, ancestral sword and beads. Now, this one shocked me, pass. Ayuri don't expose Ogiame, but Olu said Ayuri Emami is not Oluk Boshere that time. Somebody was even installed in his place then. So waiting can they bring Olok Boshere dethronement again? How many times Una want dethrone high chief Ayuri Emami? Guys, he said like Hakimi, like chief Ayuri Emami. Guys, I don't know. You guys, you know, no matter what, you must see people that will react negatively and people that will react positively. And I, I, I know that. People that react positively are those that love the king. And those that will react negatively are those that are with Ayuri and Mami. So guys, I don't know what you think about this whole thing. Just let us know in the comment section. The last but not the least. This one said, Ayuri and Mami, you have done well for the land of Ishekiri. But you can't fight a king and still want him to install you as the Ologboshere. Not done anywhere. Congratulations to our new Ologboshere, Engineer Orichema Eyewoma of the Shekiri Nation, Iwere Land. Guys, I don't know what you guys think about this. Is it even possible for the king? Do you think it is possible for the king to allow Ayuri Emami to sit next to him? After all these court cases, after everything that has been done, you think even if the king has forgiven him, he will do that? If you were to be the king, will you do it? Always put yourself first. So guys, I don't know what you think about it. Please drop your comment in the comment section respectfully. Please, you can make your comment without insulting anyone. Yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.